Marines, detail front and center. <laughs> The first fold is a symbol of life. The second fold is a symbol in the belief of eternal life. The third fold honors and remembers the veterans who have gone before us so that we may enjoy peace, liberty, and prosperity. The fourth fold represents our weaker nature, for as Americans trusting in God, it is to Him we turn for divine guidance in times of peace as well as in times of war. The fifth fold is a tribute to America. In the words of Robert Decatur, our country, in dealing with other countries, may she always be right, but she is still our country, right or wrong. The sixth fold is for where people's hearts lie. It is with their heart that they pledge allegiance to the flag and the country for which it stands. One nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. The seventh fold is a tribute to our armed forces, for it is through our armed forces that we protect our country against all her enemies, foreign and domestic. The eighth fold is a tribute to the one who entered the valley of the shadow of death, that we may see the light of day. The ninth fold is a tribute to womanhood and mothers, for it is through their faith, their love, loyalty, and devotion that the character of the men and women who have made this country great have been molded. The tenth fold is a tribute to our fathers, for they too have given their sons and daughters for the defense of our country. The eleventh fold represents the lower portion of the seal of King David and King Solomon and glorifies, in the eyes of Hebrews, the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. The twelfth fold represents an emblem of eternity and glorifies, in Christian eyes, God the Father, the Son, and Holy Spirit. The thirteenth and final fold, when the stars are uppermost, is to remind us of our national motto, In God We Trust. <laughs>